Hi, welcome to the Online Jewelry Academy. I'm John R. and I'm your instructor. A lot of students ask how they go about marking their jewelry projects. They want to know how to apply a hallmark, material content, or their signature to a piece. Well, the answers are very, very simple. The easiest way to do this is to purchase a stamp. Now, you can get a stamp through many different vendors online, and you can order them in a variety of sizes. You can get your name, you could get your logo, or you could get information regarding material content. The smallest stamps that I have here say sterling silver and 14 karat. You could get any kind of gold marking, or you could get a silver marking that says 925 if you have limited space. Now, the way that you properly use a stamp is, you want to take your stamp and you want to make sure that it is flush or flat to the hitting surface. Now, before you begin, what you might want to do, just to make sure if you're working on a piece of stock that you're going to turn into a ring or a wedding band, you may want to tape it to your bench block. That way, it won't wiggle or move and you don't hit your fingers. So, I'm going to put this right on the piece of copper that I have here and I'm going to hold it near the end. Then I'm going to take a work hammer and I'm just going to strike it once. Now that should be enough to leave a good mark. And sure enough, there's my name. Now, if you are limited on funds and you want to get the most bang for your buck, you may want to buy a vibro engraver. Now there are many of these on the market and you can get them at any hardware store. They will inscribed on metal, on glass, and on a variety of other materials. So it doesn't matter what kind of material you're working with. All you have to do is turn it on and get writing. Let me see if I can put my name down. It's not quite as neat as the stamp, but it's highly personalized. And that's probably what your clients are looking for, especially if they're collecting your work. I hope this answers your questions about marking your jewelry projects. Check out our other videos and projects on the onlinejewelryacademy.com. Thanks for watching.